Okay, um, I don't really know. Like, it seems like we're gonna be dealing with Lucas here, so that's pretty cool. So we're gonna save and, like, get that shit done. Get that shit handled. He's kind of a coward, though, so are we really gonna be handling him? But they wouldn't leave him, like, immune. Or, like, uh, they wouldn't leave him, like, unaffected. But it sounds like there's a helicopter here. And, um... Maybe maybe more was going on than, than we thought. Like, I always thought at the start of this game this is just, like, an isolated incident. That, uh... They didn't know Evelyn was here and it was just kind of lost. But it sounds to me like people were allowing Evelyn to do this and, like... Like, that that's who Lucas was communicating with? <gasps> Really? The Clarif Beast is very weak to that weapon. Why is there so many of them, though? Oh, baby, I feel good about that one. Two shots. There's literally actually so many of you and it's pissing me off. Why do you do damage per hit? In the cane form? Because the cane form is really effective- or sorry, not the cane form. The other form, the whip, because you do serrated damage and you can hit his head. And then he gets stun locked. It's really effective. It's not very hard hitting though, it's definitely his weakness. But it's more about crowd control. But it's actually really effective on bosses. Yeah. <clears throat> Burner fuel? It's almost suggesting we use burner. Oh, oh shit, oh shit, oh shit, oh shit, oh shit, no, 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 Oh, yeah, no, it's actually really effective to get in their face. That's another thing you have to kind of get you- What am I even doing here? Another thing you have to get used to, um, is you can actually stand pretty far from them and still hit them with the threaded cane. It, it's its 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 strength, for sure. My inventory is very full, but like, I just didn't know what to take out. I could have taken out the Psycho Stimulants. Maybe when I get here, I'll, I'll do that, though. Um, I'll use them. So we're going into the mine shaft now, and I'm like not down at all, let me tell you. Cause we just killed like five, um, like we killed like seven mold in there. Oh my mother of god. So he's basically a coward, so he's not gonna face us legit, huh? I'm using the good ammo, I just realized. I shouldn't be using the good ammo. Do be dealing with him though, huh? Look, I noticed it before you guys even said anything. I'm so proud of myself. Uh. What was that? What the fuck was that? What the fuck was that though? Oh. Your ass, whatever. Dude, what is this section of the game? Like, why? Like, I want to get through this, but I don't want it to be like endless freaking fight arenos. Oh no, 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 no. I mean, they're pretty scary and not VR, let me tell you. I'm the coach. Bruh, 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 no, 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 no. Dude, this is my hell. Okay, you're dead. You're deceased. Get me up. Get up, get up, get up, get up. They want to make you work for it? I feel like I'd, I've been working, though. Oh, I think you're good, Symbolic, just to check something for sure. But I, I obviously don't know. I just get the feeling, because, like, I feel like they're going to throw, like, 80 of these fuckboys at me. Oh, whiff, baby. He's whiffing. Oh, God. Oh, that took too many shots. I already destroyed the traps, though. I didn't know they'd be molded in here. 
I goofed. Whoa! Well, that would have been pretty funny if I said that and then immediately walked into one, huh? I'm already, like, out of ammo! <laughs> I gotta tell you, the most stressful part of this game is ammo management. It's actually driving me up the wall. Like, it's so stressful. Like, I thought we were, like, almost done, and then it's like, nope, time to deal with Lucas. <sighs> Yeah, but like also then they chase me and that activates my fear button. No. Whee! No, 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 they're eating me! Stop it! Exactly, Master War, you understand. We're running. They'll never catch us. Is it just me, or is this man actually running now? Okay, so this is great. What? Are you kidding me, Ethan? Ethan's too fucking, fucking powerful. Uh, I forgot about the remote bombs! Let me out, let me out. Fuck you. Where do we go? It's this way, it's gotta be this way. It's the only other way. Oh! How do I equip them? Fuck. 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 Ah, Sean, yes, hello. No, that raw button. Go, go. Wait, 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 wait. No, 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 no. Where do I go? Help me. They're eating me. No. What have I done? Oh my god, I hate you. You know what? Just kill me. What, what are you gonna do? Run. <gasps> Let me through, Tuberino. Push. Oh, oh, now. Now you can, huh? Now that. Who's gonna deceive? Maniac Hoop, hello, welcome in. Hey, welcome back, Wes. We have not killed Lucas yet. I've, I've used like five healing items. I'm out of healing items. I hate my life. I hate my life right now. <laughs> oh my god, welcome in! I really like this game, but it's just scaring me. I've been having- <gasps> Lucas! I just kind of want to die at this point. I kind of want to start that again. I feel like you might be able to soft lock Oreo hummus. Okay, should I just die? Because I use like five heals and I have like nothing and I'm all like confused. Maybe I should like just try this again. Because I can't even heal. I'm going to be blind the whole time. I can't see anything. Right, I forgot about the retry button. Ah, thank you for the reminder. I feel like you might be able to, but I don't know. This is just like uh, normal difficulty though, because I don't, I like, you know. No, we're retrying. I don't care. <laughs> Now I know what to expect. I won't use all my healing items. They're so limited. Well, it's because the mold grows everywhere, you know? So that I at least get. <gasps> I'm, I'm, I'm deceased. I'm stuck. I'm gonna die. Oh, Lucas, when I get my hands on you. Played any of the remakes? No, this is my very first Resident Evil. Well, except for Resident Evil 5, actually. Okay. Thanks, you guys. It's been about a week since my head's been clear and back to normal, and she still thinks she's got me. 
You guys really need to work on fixing that. Not only does she look like little Kim, she's but as stupid as one too. Yo, so he was communicating with him. He he wasn't he wasn't under control. Dad and mom and dad are still totally totally under though. I was wondering, is this whole family obsession something you guys program into her? It's kind of fucked up. So that's why he was locked in a cell because of Lucas. Bioweapon. So it is indeed Evelyn was a bioweapon. Ooh! Maniac! I actually got RE2. Um, and I'm gonna play it next. Uh, probably sometime after completing this game, I'm gonna replace it with RE2. So, very excited. Uh, Evelyn's family session is getting out of hand. She's making everyone kidnap more and more assholes off the street. Maybe she's getting tired of me and not coming around, but it's a pain in the ass for me because I gotta clean up the mess whenever someone new comes along. By the way, Evie's looking sick or something. Her skin is getting all wrinkly. She's getting gray hairs. <gasps> Yo, what did I say? Grandma sus as fuck. What did I say? What did I say? So, Grandma is Evelyn. Evelyn got, like, it's probably the fact that she's a bioweapon. She aged rapidly. Really? That's, like, uh, high praise. I'm very looking forward to playing it. Okay, well, I knew Grandma was sus. I totally said there's no pictures of Grandma anywhere. I feel like a golden genius. How do I heal? I, like, forgot how to heal. <laughs> oh my god. So that's really interesting. So Lucas, indeed, was not infected. He got cured, and he was communicating and coordinating in some way, shape, or form with Umbrella, probably to just, like, experiment in some way. Infection report. This report details the symptoms that appear when the bacterium that grows inside of the E-series infects a human. So it is a bacterium? Well, okay, mold is a bacterium, I guess. But is mold a bacterium? I actually don't know what, what mold is. It, it's like how it fits into the grand scheme. One picture of grandma in the guest house basement near where you first find Mia. Maybe I don't remember that. Because I thought I looked and I didn't see grandma in the picture. Because it was just a normal picture of them before they were infected. And I was like, why grandma isn't in here? Um, initial infection, the mold ingests... Nutrients from the subject's body to propagate itself and slowly takes over cells within the body. As a side effect of this, the infected subject gains remarkable regenerative abilities. It was ground by herself. Oh, okay, I think I forgot about that. Moles Marie Kondo's mortal enemy? Yes, that's why I, I summon her, like, her power to do this. Um, during experiments, we removed arms and legs from test subjects and found that they were able to collapse in the amputated limbs in a matter of minutes. Once a mold reaches the brain, the subject's thoughts become in tune with those of the E-series e asset. The subject starts to hear things and experience hallucinations, and soon comes under complete control of the E-series asset. State continues, the host will lose all sense of ego. Um, after every cell in the body has been taken over by the mold, the subject begins to lose their human form. Physical mutations differ from case to case, but all result in him or her acquiring incredible physical strength. Containing a subject at this stage would be extremely difficult. Okay, so like, this is 100% Umbrella, and they basically like, use this as a, as a faraway little lab, so Lucas could run it, I guess? Oh my god. Cell calcification. Yeah, I was gonna say, when they die, they do appear to calcify. It's pretty interesting. Oh, is this the cure? What is this? Wait, what? Oh, right, this. Oh no, this is to kill Evie. There's stories stairways in the previous room? Oh bruh. In this one? I don't see it. Did I miss it? Bottom of tubs. I 
don't see them. Be pretty well hidden. On the floor in between the two tubs. I don't see it. Like, I believe you guys, but like, wow! Was I not like right here before? Really? Oh my god, thanks guys, I appreciate that. I would have missed that completely. Okay, a special standard for disposing of e-series test subjects. Okay, and then steroids. That's very helpful. I definitely need some freaking steroids at this point. Oh, thanks guys. I actually, like, even knowing where it was, I had to keep looking. Oh my gosh. There wasn't a save point in there, right? No, okay. We just, we just progress. Okay, so we got the, the goal. Best part of streams. Will we do lore? <laughs> Did you guys see it? I didn't see it. Titanic tomorrow? Oh, you should. I've never seen Titanic. Okay, this project was instigated in 2000 as one of several concepts for the company's Nexbus, Next Generation Experimental Battlefield Superiority Initiative, working with technical assistance from HCF to develop a bioweapon for neutralizing combatants en masse with minimal direct contact. Nexbus was later folded and all its assets diverted to this project. What makes this project markedly different from conventional weapons is the ability to turn enemy combatants into allies, converting hostile elements into willing servants. Uh, not only POW handing, it's no wonder we had the blank and even blank blank organization chomping at the bit to get on board. Interesting. Princess Bride? Yo, Deadpool is a good movie. Or Princess Bride. I watched the Princess Bride once like a long time ago. Yo, Pokeo, what's up? Triple up, thank you for the follow. Rafferino evil? I'm not evil. What do you mean? That's a falsehood. Maybe a little bit evil. At times. If needed. Project would never have existed were not for the discovery in blank of blank the remarkably progressed vicariant evolution fungus that we commonly term the mutamycete. Deadpool 100%. I really like the Deadpool movie. Maniac Hoop, thank you for the follow. The fabrication method for each bioweapon was to introduce the muta... Muta meets... Muta seat... Oh my god, I can't read it. Whatever. Genome to a pre-stage 4 human embryo and perform a cultivation in a controlled environment over a period of 38 to 40 weeks. Candidate specimens. <laughs> some people like some Titanic, some people... Wait, sorry. Some people like Titanic, some people don't like Titanic. It's okay. Oh, so the reason it's E-series is that they, they messed up and then finally E worked. Common appearance was selected for the bioweapons that of a roughly 10-year-old girl to ensure ease of blending in with urban slash refugee populations. Evil. So Evelyn was able to secrete it from her tissue at will. Um... Impose a profound control over body and mind. Dude, this is creepy as heck. Don't trust little girls. That's true, Tana, but the problem is... Evelyn series. Oh. But here's the problem. is like, she wasn't even a, a creepy little girl. She was a creepy grandma at this point. Psychological shock this induces helps to break down the mind's natural barriers to Evelyn's brainwashing effect. And by the time mental control is achieved, the immunomycete uh, infection has progressed throughout the body cells to so the body blank. Okay. Okay. Jack? Miguel, hello. I mean, to be fair, it's more like don't hang out with, like, the companies that, like, experiment horrifically with children and turn them into monsters. Because, like, they, they experiment on little embryos and stuff, you know? It's Umbrella's fault. Evelyn's functions also include the ability to form organisms from mycelia, the fungal filaments. Oh, so it is fungal. 
The term organism is used loosely here. Strictly speaking, they are superorganisms formed of countless mycelia. What's important, though, is that they exhibit a strong survival instinct and will defend themselves ferociously with the slightest provocation. Their fungal toughness and remarkable strength give them significant battlefield potential. Superorganisms are molded, made of mold, and also molded as in shaped. The name has a certain elegance to it. Shut up. <laughs> oh my god. I'm so cozy. I am so cozified right now. It's mainly because I'm cold. But I'm also lowering it up. For the treatment of accidental infections, performing blank on samples of Evelyn's tissue uh, provides a unique fungicidal serum. Um, administering their serum to an infected subject will cause the mycelia to calcify, but the subject cells are already largely invaded. The serum will be fatal. Since the treatment window is so small, the serum's primary use is therefore disposal of infected subjects rather than a cure. In exploring the serum's potential, we found that subjecting it to blank would enhance its effects to extreme potency, becoming a compound we now call E-neurotoxin, necrotoxin, which blank in even tiny amounts. What's been interesting to observe in Evelyn's behavior is her obsession with the concept of family. In experiments, we found on multiple occasions that infected subjects were compelled to, ask, to act as her mother or father, treating her as if she were truly their daughter. Why did she settle upon family as a theme for her mental control? This is just speculation, but it could be that she instinctively understands that a family unit is better suited to blending into social groups than a lone girl. I mean, maybe it's because she's a kid and she's lonely? On the other hand, well, a sentimental sort might suggest that she's making up for perceived lack of love in her quarantined upbringing, a parent's love. Took away the change game option? What change game option? <laughs> I am indeed very people blanket right now. Umbrella biohacking psychological warfare for maximum biological warfare. That's a good assessment. Umbrella is like actually so freaking evil. They're like, yeah, we made a girl, but like obviously she's just like trying to blend into the wait, flame rounds? Is it grenade launcher time, you guys? Cause they do be giving me those. No bloodborne invasions pull? What? I have no idea what you're talking about, Smog. <laughs> Not gonna lie. Okay, um... I do want to make more healing, because we have literally none right now. Do I have any? Yeah, I have this. And I have this. How many herbs do I have? Three? I think we can make a little. Oops, wrong button. Ugh, all the ammo is in the wrong gun. They are indeed collecting bioweapons. What a good way to put it. Okay, I, th I think this is the best it's going to get, really, for, like, organization, unfortunately. Oops, wrong button. I have so much burner fuel. Maybe I should use some of it. But I don't really want to. It's not very effective. Maybe I should bring it with me, though. I really do have a ton of it. Maybe I will. We are very full right now. We're taking everything with us. It's such bad inventory management. I know, but we have so much ammo. We have killed quite a few molded with it. Iron worker, thank you for the follow. Welcome in. Maybe I'm just planting an idea? No, but like, I, I feel like you're... I, I don't understand what you're saying, I'm confused. But then again, I'm always confused, so like, what else is new, really? Um, we really don't have a lot of shotgun ammo, but it's so strong. We don't need this. Screw it. Uh... <laughs> Inventory management simulator stream. Yeah, I know. You know, fuck the machine gun right now. We don't have room. Okay, good enough. Okay, that's nothing. Just making sure. Thank you for the bits. Albalupus. Best things about RE. 
What the the burner or like oh so inventory management? Sorry, I was confused. We're talking about. I mean, I don't mind it, but the problem is like I feel like I'm so bad at it. You know. What did I just even pick up? Enhanced handgun ammo. Excellent. That's very nice. I don't know if this is the end boss. Is it? It might be. I don't know. Saucy, they're very scary. It's so close. And I should bring the grenade launcher. Hang on. Okay, I need to bring stuff. Not this very moment. Oh my god. I don't know what to do. I'm scared. What if I brought the wrong stuff? What if I'm a total goober and I run out of ammo? Oh, screw it. Let's just go for it. What do we got to lose? 